Yo, what's going on, y'all? So, um, got another war video coming at you today. I think this is War 4, I'm pretty sure. Um, it's for Loki versus SSX, which is gonna be pretty interesting, man. Uh, I actually was on SSX right before I came to Fort Loki. Dope group guys there, man. Um, but yeah, spoiler alert, this is not <laughs> not the best war for me or for Fort Loki in general. <laughs> um, yeah, it's not gonna be great. Um, but we're gonna get into it. Um, don't really want to, but we gotta. So yeah, we're gonna be bringing in Herc, Hulk, and Cassie today. Um, so yeah, I actually just got 7 star Hulk from a featured Paragon crystal, like literally right before this war started. So I was like, dude, I'm gonna bring Hulk to war and um, it's gonna be a good time. So yeah, uh, we're gonna be starting off over here on path 1. Um, I think we just have a spot here. So yeah, we got spot, we're gonna be using Herc, just like a little ramp up. Um, and I'm gonna, we're gonna be taking that man thing right after. So I'm gonna be using the Hulk in, I mean for man thing, and then I have like an Ebony Maw right after, which I'm gonna be taking with Cassie. So I don't have suicides on just yet. I got a bunch of big boosts on. That's not for Spot. I'm not, I'm not at all worried about Spot. I don't even have suicides on for him. Um, this is for like my fights after this, cause I, I have a pretty big run. So yeah, one thing actually, which I forgot about this, um, for this fight, is. Um, I was running, what's it called? Resonate? <laughs> so, that's kind of bad here because Spot has a um, masochism. So originally what my plan was like, just don't parry, he's never gonna get to get a debuff on him. He won't be regening and stuff. But of course I'm running Resonate, which is good for Cassie and Hulk, but bad for Herc. Um, yeah, I mean it's whatever though, it's like, what, 15% regen every couple seconds. Which Herc just out damages, so it doesn't really matter. Um, but... Yeah, it's cool. It just makes the fight a little bit longer. I don't really care. Um, yeah, so he's untouchable now. Um, so just going to back off a little bit. I could throw my special one. But the thing is, even when he's untouchable, if you do hit him um, with your true sense, you're going to get like a little rupture on you, which doesn't do too much damage. But I'd rather not. So yeah, it's cool. Spot's dead. N not really. Not really anything to worry about there, dude. Um, yeah, then next up we got Manving over here. So I could use Cassie for this fight. Cassie would be great. You just get the taunt up, and then you just keep on stinging him. But I could just use Hulk, and <laughs> I wanted to give Hulk a shot here. Um, so I'm going to throw on an Invol. Oh, I already have one on. So yeah. So he's going to be getting a lot of power from MD from the node. It has, like, resistance is futile, which, like, gives him power gain every time you're immune to something, so whenever he tries to poison me, he's going to get power gain. But that's cool. Um, I have my invul. I'm just going to be pushing him to special threes and tanking them. And then, yeah, that's, that's really it, man. So my Hulk is only rank 1. I'm going to rank 2 him like ASAP, though, because he's just, he's a monster, bro. But yeah, for now, it's whatever. We're, we're just working with it. Um, yeah, I mean, there's not really much to worry about here. I guess what could go wrong is if I do something stupid and I eat a combo before I eat a special 3, then I might be in trouble. But that's why I threw on the greater special 3 defense boost, just in case that happens, um, which that has happened to me before. <laughs> so yeah, I, I always, every time I take like a high power gain matchup, I do both invul and greater special 3 defense boost, because I don't want to be that guy who uh, just loses their invul and dies. So yeah, um, it's going pretty well so far though. We are just eating special threes. We just hit him with our special three, so we have the uh, big physical vulnerability on him. And we're also like in whatever you, whatever you call his rage phase, I don't know what it's called. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be doing a ton of damage right, right when we come out of this. And uh, let's see. Yeah, dude, we, we got some pretty big hits there. We're just gonna go for the stun lock now. This should be enough to kill him um, before it even ends. So yeah, dude, Hulk is, Hulk is pretty good, man. Super glad I got him at the seven star. He's, he's just a monster. <laughs> But yeah, now moving on, we got Ebony Maw in Node 23. I'm pretty sure we've seen Ebony Maw here every single war. Oh, no, no, every single war but one. So one time, I think when we faced New Nation, there was a Jabari Panther on there, which I just used Herc for. Um, but yeah, every other war, we've seen Maw there, which I'm not sure why, because he hasn't gotten any kills there at all. I mean, we also put our Ebony Maw on Node 23, because he used to be good, but he hasn't been good, dude. Um... Yeah, I don't think he got us any kills either. He's not getting them kills, he's not getting us kills. So we might need to change that, dude. <laughs> um, 
But yeah, you can see he's being kind of annoying here. He's finally just throwing his special one. And we're just going to miss the last hit and then throw our heavy attack. I mean, this is just like clockwork for us right now. We've taken this so many times with Cassie. And we haven't died yet. So yeah, it's pretty hard to die with Cassie here. Just because she's just like such a tank, dude. And Ebony Ma just hits like a baby. Um, I guess you could eat a special too. And then that Degen gets pretty nasty. But the thing is with Cassie, you keep up the taunt. He's usually pretty happy to throw a special one most of the time. Which is why I love her. You know, that taunt is... Usually, most of the time, it works. <laughs> um, there are certain champs who their taunt doesn't work. <laughs> I'm at him. But yeah, Cassie's taunt is pretty good. Um, yeah. So yeah, this this one actually went a lot better. If you watched the last war video, Ebony Ma was not playing ball. And it took like way too long to kill him, like over two minutes. It was stupid. Like I killed Sasquatch, like a rank two Sasquatch boss, faster than I killed Ebony Ma because he just was not playing ball. Um, but yeah. Anyways, he's dead now. He was he was playing ball today. Next up, we're going to note 26 here. We have Mysterio. Um, we're going to be using Herc here, which on paper isn't the greatest idea because this has Hazard Shift, Shock, and Bleed. Um, he is not Shock, nor is he Bleed Immune. I got a uh, Gallon Seed on this. Um, so, I mean, this is the first fight with it, so it's not going to give me any resistance to damaging debuffs. But, it's fine. Um, we're just gonna try to hit him during the bleed phase, because Herc naturally has like a 50% resistance to bleed. Um, paired with Coagulate, I run 3 out of 3. That gives him 80% bleed resistance. So yeah, I mean, he is kind of immune to bleed. If I had more fights before this with the Gallon Seed, then it would be better, because I'd be like fully resistant to bleed. Um, but I don't, so it's fine, dude. I'm just gonna try to... Uh, just, you know, just hit him during the bleed phase. Don't, I mean, I, I still, I just got a shock of me like a second ago, but that's fine. I'm going to try not to get too many of them, but I got my power star one boost on. I got to my special two, I threw it, and look at that dude. He's like, he's almost dead now. A um, couple more combos should put him down. And he's at special two, so I'm just going to let him throw it. I could have just yellowed it, went in for the combo into my special one, which might have killed him. But, I mean, I guess we're playing safe today. So yeah, we got a little intercept off. Um, we're just going to go in for another combo to a special one. And he's dead. So yeah, we actually came out of there with like a lot more health than I thought I was going to. I was expecting to lose a bunch of health, but I did not, which is great because Herc is that guy, even on Hazard Shift apparently. Um, moving on now, we have a Korg here. Um, I'm going to be using Herc again, which Herc is pretty good for Korg. Um, I mean, he's not the greatest, obviously, because I mean, with the tactic, if you crit, then they get the prowess and they get the power gain. Um, but that's fine. I'm going to try not to go for my precisions. Usually you want to go for like special one, special two, like if you're doing battlegrounds. Um, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go for straight for special two because I don't want to crit too much and give him too much power. But yeah, one thing that was happening was pretty weird. Like if you saw, <laughs> if you saw that, um, I try to go for like j just what I did right there. So when Quark charges his heavy attack, usually with Herc's light reach, you just do two lights like that and then you can hit him. But then the spacing was really weird. For some reason, I was whiffing. Um, yeah, so usually the second hit hits him like that, but then I was just whiffing like a whole bunch of them for some reason, which is, just, I don't know why that was happening, dude. Um, it's whatever though, but we're just gonna throw another special two, he goes down. I lost a little bit of health, but that's fine. Um, yeah, Korg's dead, Herc's pretty good. Um, let's keep on going, dude. Let's see. We have Shocker here, um, not sure why Shocker's here. He has a really easy heavy to heavy counter. Um, we're going to be using Herc again. I think Korg would have been better on this node because Korg is actually a little bit harder to knock down than Shocker. But, whatever, man. I'm not doing a defense. Uh, <laughs> my guy Nah is. Which, Nah, I, I, I don't know. I don't know why Shocker's here, dude. Um, <laughs> I love though. That's my guy, dude. <laughs> that is my guy. Although, he is a fraud because as a balanced designer for Kabam, he's using Hercules in War, which goes absolutely against everything balance stands for. Um, Herc is not at all balanced, which is why I love him, because, I mean, he's just, he's that guy, and that, right there, I did that on purpose, actually, I wanted to get an extra feat of strength by eating his special one, because it did, like, zero damage anyway, so, yeah, look at that, dude, um, we're gonna just combo him, and he's gonna die, oh, no, we went for the heavy feat, okay, yeah, I guess I didn't get my heavy feat, and so I got three feats of strength from this fight, actually, which is, which is pretty OP, dude, um, I'm not sure that I need them because I have the Hulk synergy, but whatever, man, I'll take it. 
And I think we just go straight into the Wong fight here because I have a. Do I, what do I have here? Like a combat region or something? I think. Maybe I have a power star one boost on here. What do, what do I have? I don't know, dude. Um, but yeah, I mean, Cassie. Cassie versus Wong. This is also a nothing fight. Um, I guess the only thing about this node is that Wong can charge his little heavy attack and gain power. Because technically, you're not supposed to like hit him while like parry heavy him to take the protection off because it has like what's it called um one eye open so he's just gonna reflect any damage while stunned but that's whatever dude um cassie doesn't need a parry heavy him she just charges heavy and he misses so yeah she's pretty great for this node um yeah it's going great so far dude it's just cassie versus long and then you, you really don't have to worry about her stuff unstoppable annoying abilities because cassie's both immune so she kind of just makes him a potato which is great um yeah, it's going pretty great so far. It's, I mean, it's kind of slow, but Cassie's like super safe. Um, as long as she doesn't whiff. Cassie has a tendency to whiff sometimes, which we're going to see in the fight after this. <laughs> uh, it's not going to be great, man. It's not at all going to be a good time. But yeah, we haven't whiffed yet, which is great. I'm, I wish she would never whiff, but apparently they're fixing her whiffs next month, which is like September. So, yeah, next month's update, she should no longer whiff, but we're gonna have a, <laughs> we're gonna have a fight right now. We're taking Cassie versus Kindred on node 49. So this node, it has hazard shift, incinerate, poison. So Cassie's immune to poison, she's not immune to incinerate. Um, yeah, so, I mean, the thing is with her taunt, it's really strong with paired with an equity. You can actually heal from the incinerates. So once you get your taunt up, then you should be safe to just hit him in both phases. Right now, I'm just, just waiting out the phase until it goes to poison, and I'm going to start hitting him. Um, so, yeah, right here, he's in poison now. I'm just going to start hitting him. I'm trying to build up to a bar of power, and then, yeah, he's being kind of weird, but it's fine. Um, yeah, so we're at about a, a bar of power now. And then I think we just need to punish his... Yeah, so we throw the special one there and it whiffs. <laughs> so we don't have the taunt, which is really bad. And we lost our invul. And we... Okay, we're doing okay there. So yeah, her special one is really bad with the whiffs. But then, yeah, so you see, you see we don't have the taunt yet. We need to get that up if, you've, if we want to hit him during incinerate. So I'm going to throw my special one right here, I think. Okay, that one does not whiff, so we're safe. So at this point, the fight's going pretty okay. Um, I ate that, which is completely terrible. I should not have... Uh, that was a really bad timing to eat it. So that one was on me. That's not on Cassie. Um, <laughs> I, I, sh I just screwed up that dex. The, the timing is weird. You can see it's degening like everything. Because if you eat it like right before his stupid little degen phase then you're kind of screwed because it keeps his other, like, his passive degen stacks on you, which is terrible. You don't want that. Um, but yeah, I think at this point we're okay. We kind of recovered from it, um, but we're not we're not past the worst part yet. <laughs> not at all. Um, yeah. Uh, it's fine, though. So we go here for another special one, and it whiffs, and that, that seals the deal, man. So I lose the taunt. Um, I can't I, I ate a combo, which is also bad. You know, you don't want to eat combos. Um, so we're not in a great place right now, dude. He's about to enter his little degen phase again, which is really bad. It is terrible, dude. Um, but, and right there, I screwed up again. I waited too long before dashing in and then missing the second part of a special one. So yeah, that's also on me. I mean, I screwed up like twice here, which, I mean... Screwing up with Cassie isn't usually the end of the world, like, there's usually room to screw up, but if you screw up too many times, you're gonna die, dude. And so I screwed up twice, and I whiffed twice, so that's four screw-ups total, which, I mean, that, that's, that's enough to kill you, man. <laughs> four four screw-ups against a mini-boss like Kindred, you're probably gonna die, so, yeah, we, we throw the special one. But we're getting ticked down by the incinerates because no taunt. We just get the taunt up, but it's too late, and we're dead. <laughs> so yeah, dude, um, that was pretty frustrating. I I did screw up that fight. Like it, it wasn't perfect, but then, just 
the compounding of everything that's that's how you die dude so i died there um blame cassie dude <laughs> i mean it, it wasn't a perfect fight but there should be room to screw up a little bit but i mean yeah it's whatever dude uh i just can't wait for the fix coming next month uh until then i don't think i'm gonna be using cassie in war just because i you should not be dying because like of a bug <laughs> it's stupid it's just yeah this is like you should be dying in war because of that dude um so yeah it's whatever um i'm just cleaning up with hulk and yeah it's fine i'm, I'm like <laughs> uh, it's cool it's cool so I'm eating a little bit of hits, but it's fine. I have full health. I'm just gonna hit him. He's gonna die. So yeah, that's that's whatever. Just a clean up. Um, but yeah. Um, so that's the first part of the war. And you see that photon boss right there. We are going to be taking that with Herc. <laughs> and I was live streaming actually. Uh, I think it was the next day because we have like the two day attack phase now. And then the photon boss just opened up. And then, I mean, I, I was feeling. I mean, so we we already lost the war at this point. We were down by like. 10 deaths which is <laughs> which is not not too great for us but yeah we really lost the war i was streaming and i was kind of just having a, like a yolo moment i was like hey this is a pretty cool fight man um i should just i should just live stream it so yeah we are going to um get into that really quick uh so yeah i, I took war boss live and <laughs> full disclosure it also does not go the greatest but it's cool Let's go ahead. Where was my power store one dude? Did I not throw it on? Did I throw on the wrong dude? I might have thrown on the wrong dude. Did I throw on an invoy? I'm stupid. That's sad. That is also bad. Don't throw it. No. Oh, dude. We were so close, bro. Uh. Well, we died. <laughs> Dude, if I had my Power Star 1 boost on, I'm so stupid. Yeah, so a couple things went wrong there. <laughs> um, yeah, so first thing, I used the Power Star 1 boost, and during the fight, I didn't see the Power Star 1 like come on as soon as it started. So I was like, I thought I screwed up and I threw on an invul, which I didn't because I did throw on a Power Star 1 boost. The thing is, Photon has this ability where when she puts it or when you get a debuff she puts like a petrify on you for like 0.5 seconds so she basically cancels out the power start one boost if you're running suicide because you start with a debuff right um so yeah that's one thing i did not know going into this i don't think anybody knew that it's pretty crazy um she just ner nerfs power start one boost if you're running recoil <laughs> um and then the second thing is uh, I mean, I was doing this live on a stream, so <laughs> I was not playing the best. Usually when you stream, you don't play the best. If you saw, I ate a massive combo and triggered immortality, um, which was bad. I should not have, <laughs> should not have done that. Um, I, I could have, I saw a lot of places where I could have played that better. I, I let myself get cornered, so I couldn't really get the uh, three cruelties at the beginning. I only got one from my special two. Um, yeah, just a lot of room for improvement there. And yeah, so that was not the 
cleanest fight. <laughs> but, you know, we do take Photon Boss, a Photon Boss again in the next war. So we got a little shot at redemption there. Stay, st <laughs> stick around for that. I'll probably post that video tomorrow. Um, but yeah, it's cool. It is what it is. I, I was not too worried about dying here. Th that's why I live streamed it, because I literally died the fight before. If I had like a, like a deathless streak going into this, then I would not have live streamed it. I would have just done it like in silence and peace where I could focus. <laughs> but then I figured since we, we, we lost the war already, we, I mean, even if I soloed, we weren't going to win. Um, I died literally the fight before, so I don't have a streak whatsoever going into this. And I mean, it was just like, it was a cool fight. It was my first time doing it. So like, why not, dude? Um, so yeah, I, I, don't, I don't feel like too bad about dying there. Um, it's cool. We, we can do it again the next war. <laughs> but yeah, so here's the final score. Um, 7 to 17, not, not the greatest at all, man. <laughs> we, we have not been playing great. But it's cool, man. We are going to get better. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> holding on to hope, man. I'm just holding on. But yeah, um, we are going to call it there. Appreciate y'all watching. And yeah, take care. <laughs>